Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gorn. In our today's video, we will talk about dividing decimals by a whole number. So without further ado, let's do this topic. We have here two different examples wherein we will divide a decimal by a whole number. This decimal will serve as your dividend while this whole number will serve as your divisor. So let's try and find their quotient. So first, we will write this in long division form. This inside this part, we have 5.35. So I need to extend this and your divisor will be placed outside. Now, if you're dividing a decimal by a whole number, you can directly bring up your decimal here because this will be the place of your decimal point when you get the quotient of your example. Okay, you can bring up, automatically bring up your decimal point. So first, so we have five divided by five, that is equal to one. One times five, that is equal to five. Okay, subtract this numbers, this is zero, and then bring down, bring down three. So our routine here is that we will divide multiply, subtract, and bring down. So let's continue. We have 3 divided by 5 that is equal to 0. Next, 0 times 5 that is equal to 0. And then subtract these numbers. So we have now 3 minus 0 is 3. And then bring down 5. So as you can see, we have now 35. And 35 divided by 5 is equal to 7. 7 times 5 is equal to 35. So we will subtract this and automatically your remainder is zero. Meaning the quotient is 1.07. Or in other words, 5.35 divided by 5 is equal to 1.07. Okay? So let's continue with item number two. For number two, we are given 8.342 divided by 2. So this is your dividend and this is your quotient. So we will place it here. 8.342 and your divisor outside this one. So again, since we are dividing by a whole number, we can automatically bring up our decimal point. What is 8 divided by 2? That is equal to 4. Then multiply 4 times 2, which is equal to 8 and then subtract it, this is 0, then bring down 3, so 3 divided by 2 is 1, 1 times 2 is 2, subtract, that is equal to 1, bring down 4, so we have now 14, 14 divided by 2 is 7, and 7 times 2, that is equal to 14, that is 0, when we subtract it, bring down 2, okay, so 2, divided by 2 is equal to 1 so we don't have enough space here so I'm gonna move this paper okay so 2 divided by 2 is 1 so we are done with that so 1 times 2 is 2 and subtract these numbers 2 minus 2 is equal to 0 since your remainder is equal to 0 automatically and uh, hindi na natin kailangan mag-extend ng ating pang decimal values so as you can see the quotient here is 4.171. In other words, when we divide 8.342 by 2, that is equal to 4.171. So, you hope guys you learned something from this video. And as our routine, I will give you another example, number 3, wherein you need to answer this after watching the video. So, I want you to to divide 3.63 by 3. So you hope na makita ko ang inyong answer within our comment section. So guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. By the way guys, you can also follow me sa ating Facebook page which is Ako si Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!